more appropriate place, and what more appropriate time, and what more appropriate way to celebrate freedom, redemption, renewal, than giving this block the proper recognition it deserves being the block that hosted the first show in North America. So today, I feel proud to say the Jewish community is back on South William Street. God bless you all. God bless this wonderful country. And have a very... Site of the Mill Street Synagogue, first Jewish synagogue in North America. It was on this site on April 8, 1730. The Mill Street Synagogue was consecrated and opened its doors for worship, led by Rabbi Gershom Mendez Sisis. This synagogue was the home of Congregation Sherith Israel. Congregation Sherith Israel was formed with the arrival of Asher Levi and his congregation of 22 Jewish men, women, and children at Bowling Green in Lower Manhattan in September 1654 near this site. They were the first observant Jews ever in North America. The Mill Street Synagogue continued as an active Jewish synagogue until 1817. Sponsored by Lower Manhattan Historical Association, Bowling Green Association, Gift of Reckless Philanthropy, September 2019. While there will be great pomp and ceremony on Friday, September 6, 2019, on South William Street for the dedication of the permanent Mill Street Synagogue plaque, allow me to share what will also be countless unnoticed but equally memorable moments beginning that day for generations to come. 
Maybe on a cold winter day as the sun sets and darkness begins to descend and snow begins to fall. And one or two individuals just happen to be walking along South William Street and notice a plaque on the wall and stop to read it and learn what they did not know, had no reason to expect that they were standing on a very historic place where way back in 1730, the first Jewish synagogue in North America stood. And because of this brass plaque on the wall, they will always remember the day they were walking down South William Street in Lower Manhattan. Moments like this will be true beginning later this year and just as well a hundred years from now and more.